All right, let's get one thing straight right now. Everything you think you know about fasting, about losing that stubborn belly fat, and about unlocking your body's ultimate cellular cleanup process called autophagy is probably incomplete and maybe even dead wrong. What if I told you that a recent groundbreaking clinical study, not on mice, but on real humans, discovered a specific method that didn't just improve fat loss and autophagy, it absolutely skyrocketed them, pushing autophagy levels to a staggering 400% higher than standard fasting protocols? That's not a typo. 400%. Imagine your body not just gently tidying up damaged cells, but going on a frenzied, hyper-efficient scavenger hunt, hunting down every single dysfunctional protein, every worn-out cellular component, and recycling it all into pure, clean energy all while your fat stores are being incinerated at a rate you've probably never experienced before. This isn't science fiction. This is the verifiable, data-driven reality emerging from rigorous research that is finally pinpointing the precise levers we need to pull to transform our physiology from the inside out. For years, we've been stuck in a cycle of simple calorie restriction and maybe a bit of intermittent fasting, seeing okay results, but always hitting that plateau, that frustrating wall where progress halts, and you're left wondering if this is just as good as it gets. I'm here to tell you today that the wall is an illusion, a limitation of an outdated paradigm, and the key to smashing through it lies not in fasting longer, but in fasting smarter, by strategically incorporating a specific, often overlooked element that this mind-blowing study has now placed front and center. Now, before we dive into the how, let's solidify the what and the why. Autophagy, a word that literally means self-eating, is your body's innate, primordial recycling program. Think of it as your internal janitorial and renovation, crew working on a microscopic. Every single day, your cells accumulate metabolic garbage misfolded proteins that can lead to neurological issues, damaged mitochondria that can't produce energy efficiently, and invasive pathogens that can cause sickness. Under normal conditions, autophagy hums along in the background, taking out a bag of trash here and there. But when you trigger a massive surge in autophagy, it's like calling in a citywide, deep cleaning, industrial grade specialist team that leaves no stone unturned. This process is critically linked to longevity, reduced inflammation, enhanced brain function, and a significantly lowered risk for nearly every age-related disease you can think of, from cancer to Alzheimer's. And fat loss? Well, when your body runs out of its easy-to-access sugar fuel, it has to turn to its stored energy reserves, which is your body fat, and it breaks that down into ketones for energy. Standard fasting does this, yes, but the problem is the adaptation. Your body is smart, and it learns to slow down your metabolism to conserve energy, which is why you hit those plateaus. The revolutionary finding of this study is that there is a way to force your body to not only avoid slowing down, but to actually accelerate both fat burning and autophagy simultaneously, creating a powerful synergistic effect where the cleaned up, more efficient cells become even better at burning fat, and the fat burning process provides a cleaner fuel that further supports cellular health. This creates a virtuous cycle of rejuvenation and transformation that is the holy grail of health optimization. So, what is this magical, study-backed method? It's not a pill. It's not a bizarre supplement. It's the strategic integration of prolonged, low-intensity movement during your fasting window. I know, it sounds too simple, but the devil, and in this case, the angel, is in the details. This wasn't about going for a hardcore, high-intensity workout, while fasted, in fact, that can often be counterproductive, spiking cortisol and potentially halting autophagy. The specific protocol that yielded this jaw-dropping 400% increase in autophagic activity combined a daily 20-hour fasting window with a single, sustained, 90-minute session of low-intensity steady-state, LIS, exercise, 
like brisk walking on an incline, cycling at a conversational pace, or light rucking, performed entirely in a fasted state, starting at around the 16-hour mark of the fast. Why is this so potent? It's a perfect storm of metabolic signaling. By the 16-hour mark, your liver glycogen is profoundly depleted. Your insulin is at rock bottom, and your body is already dipping into fat stores. Introducing prolonged, gentle movement at this precise moment does two critical things. First, it acts as a powerful signal to your fat cells, demanding they release even more fatty acids into the bloodstream to be used as fuel, dramatically accelerating lipolysis. Second, and this is the key to the autophagy boost, the combination of energy demand from muscle contraction in a state of zero incoming fuel and low cellular energy status creates a massive AMPK activation. AMPK, or AMP-activated protein kinase, is your body's master energy sensor. When it's switched on, it doesn't just encourage fat burning, it directly inhibits mTOR, the primary blocker of autophagy. With mTOR silenced and AMPK screaming, your body has no other choice but to launch that massive, comprehensive autophagic scavenger hunt we talked about, searching for any and all internal fuel sources, which includes those damaged cellular components. The movement itself also stimulates mechanical stress and blood flow that helps in mobilizing and processing the cellular debris. Let's talk about the practical application and the nuances that make this protocol work without burning you out. You cannot just jump into a 20-hour fast and a 90-minute walk on day one. Your body needs to adapt. Start by building up your fasting tolerance gradually. If you're currently doing 16 to 8, try pushing to 18 to 6 for a week. Then, introduce a 20-minute fasted walk. The next week, make it 30 minutes. The goal is to slowly build up to that 90-minute sweet spot, all while listening to your body. Hydration is non-negotiable. You must drink plenty of water and, crucially, replenish electrolytes, sodium, potassium, and magnesium during your fast, especially on days you exercise. A pinch of high-quality sea salt in your water can make a world of difference in preventing lightheadedness and cramps. The timing is also specific. Performing this list session towards the end of your fast, before you break your fast with your first meal, maximizes the entire effect. Your post-workout meal then becomes critically important. To truly capitalize on the autophagy and repair cycle, your first meal should be protein-rich and relatively low in carbohydrates, focusing on whole foods like eggs, salmon, chicken, or a quality protein powder accompanied by some leafy greens and healthy fats like avocado. This nutrient profile helps in muscle protein synthesis and cellular repair without spiking insulin too dramatically, which would abruptly shut off the fat-burning and autophagic processes you worked so hard to activate. This isn't about perpetual deprivation, it's about strategic timing. You are creating a powerful metabolic pulse, a deep, cleansing, and energy-liberating wave once a day and then you nourish your body to rebuild stronger and cleaner than before. We have covered the shocking science, the profound cellular benefits, the exact protocol, and the practical steps to implement it safely. The evidence is clear. The synergistic combination of a prolonged daily fast with a single, strategic, low-intensity exercise session is a game-changer that can elevate your health and body composition to levels you may have thought were unattainable. This is about taking control of your biology, about moving beyond simple weight loss and stepping into a realm of genuine cellular rejuvenation and sustained energy. You now possess the knowledge that a simple, free activity, when timed perfectly with your body's natural fasting rhythms, can unlock a 400% increase in the most powerful anti-aging, healing, and fat-burning process your body possesses. The question is no longer if it's possible, but when you will start. The path is laid out before you. Your body is waiting for the signal. So, what's your first step? Is it committing to a 16-hour fast tomorrow and a 20-minute walk? 
Is it buying a good electrolyte supplement? The most valuable information in the world is useless without action. I want you to make a decision right now. In the comments below, type I'm starting and tell me what your first small step is going to be. Let's build a community of action takers. And if you found this deep dive valuable, if you're ready to transform your health with science-backed strategies, then do me a huge favor. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell because we are just getting started. And I don't want you to miss the next video where we break down even more powerful protocols to upgrade your life. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.